Hey everyone, Shadow here, and welcome to another Marvel Contest of Champions video. So it's season 28, and this is war number four. And looks like we're going up against an alliance called Manners Maketh Man. Interesting. All right, so let's take a look, um, see what their defense looks like for us. I'm so tired, guys. Just got home not that long ago. Just made that video, so I'm late getting into uh, war here. All right, so I take path three, and they didn't place anyone on that first node. Thank you. Second node is a Black Panther. Uh, not too bad there. Uh, the mini boss, um, he can be annoying, but he shouldn't be uh, too much of a problem uh, as long as I'm careful. They've already cleared the middle. Uh, we've got Heimdall. Uh, I don't think he is that difficult, but I don't remember fighting him on this node. Uh, so I could be wrong. Uh, Cosmic Ghost Rider, not too worried about him on that node. Uh, then we've got uh, Sorcerer Supreme. Shouldn't be an issue. Uh, basically, Black Widow Clairvoyant can do uh, both of these fights. Nick Fury can handle that uh, Sorcerer Supreme. Just, you know, nuke her down, pretty much. Uh, I bring uh, Warlock as well. Now, this mini up here, uh, Doom, can be a pain. He can be a, a right pain. Uh, if I need to... Uh, I can fight him with Nick Fury, uh, maybe boost up, because Kabam has given us so many boosts. I have some expiring. Um, I can boost up and just go all out with Nick Fury. Um, if I get hit with the, uh, you know, special three, you know, if I have the invulnerability boost on, you know, I should be able to survive it. Um, so that's an option. Warlock. Uh, is another option uh, because this one does have uh, buffet on. Um, so that can be a pain, but I believe uh, we have somebody uh, on the left side bringing Human Torch. So that shouldn't be a problem. All right. Um, but we'll see. If I end up fighting him, uh, if the Human Torch, you know, fails, uh, I'll probably... Uh, clean up with uh, Nick Fury. And we got Mini Boss Island here. We've got uh, Mojo at the bottom there. That's Human Torch food. Thing off to the right. Nick Fury can do it. Um, but I prefer not to. I hate that node. Uh, and we've got Black Widow Daily Origins. I don't know if she's still bugged. Um, but that's evil putting her on that node. If she's still bugged, but we want somebody that can shut down evade. And off to the left, we've got now this is a tricky one because I've fought him uh, here before. Um, this guy, um, Hulk Buster on this node. It's rage, right? But the problem comes in the extend. This is a, a good placement and I got caught by this. You don't want to push him to a special two on this node. Because of the extend, his special two is unblockable. And unless you know how to evade his special two, you're gonna get hit. Um, his special one, not a problem. The special two with the extend, problem. So that's how you do. Um, we've got uh, Bishop. I don't remember fighting Bishop since his rework uh, on this node. I think you want an incinerate immune uh, champion uh, to take him. So yeah, not sure. Not sure how that goes. Um, we'll, we'll see if I'm asked to take that side. And then we've got Mangog. Now that fight right there. No, we want human torch to fight. Oop, I just saw Lalo move. Um, we want human torch on that fight. If we can help it, if not, you know, I'll fight with whoever I have. All right. So let me uh, end this portion and then record the fight, get in here, and actually make some uh, moves, use up some energy. All right, so we'll be right back with the fighting.
All right, so we're back. And as you can see, I chose to go in with my standard attack team, Warlock, Nick Fury, and Black Widow Clairvoyant. Uh, I do run suicides. Uh, you can see Black Widow Clairvoyant is a six star. She is rank three. Uh, both of the others are five star rank fives. All right, so as you saw earlier, they did not place a defender on that first node. Uh, but I do have a defender on the second node on my path, which is path three in section one. And this is Black Panther. Now he just got a rework, his animations are different. So I had to get used to his new animations, but he's not a difficult defender. And it's common for them to place the less def you know difficult defenders early on in section one. Uh, Honestly, we should not be dying in sections one on non minis. Okay, path clearing, we shouldn't die. Our death should be on the minis. So we got Black Panther down without any difficulty. Um, Clairvoyant, even if I had gotten hurt, uh, I knew I'd be able to heal up with Claire, so wasn't too worried. Now, be because I did not do any fighting on that first node, I only had one fight on my path. I almost feel obligated to take the mini. So I usually do. Uh, I factor that in when I'm doing my scouting and everything. Uh, so this guy here, Spider-Man Stealth Suit, is somewhat annoying, but you see how I, you know, kind of baited out and didn't do a full five hit combo, baited out that um, evade. He works similarly to Miles Morales the way he did before the buff. Funny enough, the Miles Morales buff made him much easier to fight. I don't have to worry about baiting out all of those evades. But Stealth Suit Spidey, what you want to do is, while he has that spider sense up, you don't want to do full five hit combos. You know, do a one or a one two, you know, something like that. And when he evades and it's on cooldown, that's when you can go and fight him. And I was playing a little cautiously uh, because I remember when he first came out, the difficulty that I had uh, fighting him. All right, so uh, that's it for section one. You can see here, the middle is cleared. Um, my battle group was moving, let me tell you. Uh, but that was it for that day. This is the next day here. And uh, the pathway is clear. That little mini, I guess you would call it, uh, was already taken down. And now I'm on to my next path, which is also path three in section two. And we're fighting a cosmic ghost rider. And I wasn't too worried about him. I can evade both of his specials uh, pretty easily. Uh, given the way the game is right now, uh, I'm a little nervous about evading at all. But as you can see here, uh, she's chewing him up. Now, I wasn't worried because as far as I remember, he doesn't get an armor up, but... I need to look in his kit because I noticed that she was uh, nullifying his armor up. So maybe the node was giving it to him um, because I don't remember it being in his kit, but it didn't matter. Black Widow Clairvoyant is the goat for this path and that node in particular. Now you can take that node with a bleed immune champion as well, you know, so, um, but Claire is just so perfect for it. And if you're running, um, you know, Mystic Dispersion, crazy good. Now, this next fight is against Sorcerer Supreme. And I like fighting her with Nick Fury, not only because he has that safety net, but she doesn't gain power like other champions. So I can just wail on her, as you see here. Um, no strategy, just going in, boom, boom, boom. Uh, I don't know how to evade her special one fully. So you can see there, I blocked the first two and then I evaded the last one. Uh, her special two is easier to evade for me. I can fully evade that. But you can see here, I just went all in and just crushed her, okay? No problems there. Um, I've had difficulty fighting her on other nodes where she gains a lot of power. Uh, kinetic transference, I know, is annoying uh, to deal with her on. Now, look at this. The mini was taken. But that's not all. I told you my BG was moving, right? Look at this. We get down to Mini Boss Island, and there's no mini bosses. They've cleared it all out and taken the boss down. 
So that's going to do it for my participation in this war. They didn't need me for any of the minis or anything like that. Um, so good war. <laughs> Uh, so after a little intermission, uh, we will be back and you'll find out how this war ended. And we're back. And as you can see, we lost this war. Uh, I was not surprised when I looked at our diversity. And I'm going to show it because I'm ashamed of it. But we did fix it later on. But that's what our diversity was at this point. And uh, we were dying way too much as well. So we've got some things to work on. We really do. Um, but that's going to do it, guys. Thank you all for watching the video. Feel free to hit that like button if you enjoyed the video. Leave a comment. Let me know what you thought about this video. What do you think about uh, that diversity? Take care. And you all have a blessed day.